So, you know, that's what's wrong with the entrepreneurs these days is they're getting advice from people that have kind of put a nice little bow around things and it looks pretty and sounds nice, but it's actually not the real thing. Um, well, I think I think a lot of the young entrepreneurs, I think what they're doing wrong is they're listening to the wrong people. Um, I think you gotta be very careful about who you listen to and you have to do your homework and find out, okay, are you listening to somebody who's actually done what you want to do? Um, not think they're an expert at it because they think they're an expert at it, but they actually had, you know, or have done something in the physical universe that like replicates that. So. You know, if you want to build a healthcare company, do you want to get advice from somebody that's built a healthcare company or somebody that's consulted? Like, um, I think the I, I think somebody that I, I think that nobody should take advice on in terms of leadership is uh, uh, Simon Sinek. Uh, the reason why is because he's never built a company. He's never he's never owned a company that has more than three employees. So you can't take leadership advice from somebody that has never built a company, that has never had hundreds or thousands of employees. Um, you gotta be able to do that first before you can give advice on that thing. And people get wrapped up in the nomenclature of it and they get wrapped up in the, wow, it sounds pretty and nice and you know, leadership is this, and leadership is that. It's like, no dude, like get leadership advice from people that have built companies. Like find an owner of a company that has built it up um, has either sold it or is continuing to build it and has done it for decades, that's the person you want to get leadership advice from, not not this other guy who's a consultant and has three employees and probably works out of his you know garage.